Good morning. Day four. Wow, look at this. Don't believe the weather forecast. It says it's gonna rain for the whole month. Sunny, blue skies, very hot. I just had a delicious Eggs Benedict breakfast with pineapple juice, uh, 155,000 dong. What's that, about $10, $12. And last night, I went on a food tour, Da Nang food tour with An. Uh, it's called Da Nang food tour, just search that. I'll put the links below. Awesome, so good. We had about eight, 10 different foods. I was so full. My favorite was the ban chow, I think it is, like the Korean pancake into the peanut sauce. Mwah. And then we finished off with coconut ice cream. Also very delicious. So now, I thought it was gonna rain, so I've already booked to go to Hue. Uh, so I'm gonna go there today uh, on the train. Hopefully go past the Haivan Lu Pass. We gotta try to get a ticket on that side of the train. That's gonna be the challenge. But, before I go to Hue, I need to go for a swim. Look at it. There are yellow and red flags up here. I see people in the water up here, so I'm gonna have a quick jump in, hopefully dry off really fast, pack my bag, and head to Hawaii. Let's go. This is why I chose Da Nang first. For the beach. All right, I have made it to Hue. Hue is the old capital of Vietnam. Just been strolling around. Tomorrow we'll do all the historic stuff. Try to find a tour. You can catch these boats around. They're saying 100,000 dong. I, I'm gonna research if that's the right price or that's Keith's price. <laughs> I feel like I'm getting ripped off. While the sun's setting, let's explore.
All right, day two. Day two, I'm about to go on a tour to the Citadel. Uh, let's explain. Last, yesterday I did go on the train from Da Nang to Hue. It was about two and a half hours. Uh, the trick is to try to sit on the right side. I had to sit on the left side, the Haivan Pass, wait, you know, whatever that famous pass name is, uh, is on the right side. So uh, if you can book your seat on the right side, that's the trick. So I found a tour online. It's going to cost me $45 and we'll go there now. It's a beautiful day. Um, yeah, so let's go check out Hue, the Citadel. All right, this pagoda was built in 1601, seven stories high. I 
Uh, they added some on in 1630. I don't know too much more about <laughs> that. Um, it was about a 30 minute boat ride uh, along the river. Uh, very pleasant, it's a nice day. Got mountains in the background. It's nice and shaded. So let's just have a look around. I've got 30 minutes and I've got to head back to the boat. This is why I recommend get tours of places. I'm not really sure what I'm looking at. So I got a tour of the Citadel, the palace, and that was good. I think you can get audio guide tours, but I enjoy a tour guide. I had it all by myself again, um, so they seem a bit quiet, so if you're in the area, get a tour guide. Um, I think it was $45, which is quite a lot, but I gave her a tip, she was really good. And you can talk about the palace, you can ask questions. The audio guides, you can't ask questions, and get further information so that's why I prefer people <laughs> So the monk got out of his car and then he burned himself which is a famous image of Vietnam a guy burning himself against uh, religious freedoms yeah so he got out of his car and then burned himself hmm very quiet and peaceful here roosters and locusts or crickets, I think they're locusts, yeah. Very quiet.